Hi, I'm Tom Breitling, Chairman of Ultimate Gaming. There's a number I want to tell you about that's very important. It tells you how much you love poker and much more than that. On April 30th, 2013, we launched UltimatePoker.com as the first real money regulated online poker site in America. Our company immediately became a clear demonstration of the pent-up online demand for one of America's favorite pastimes. Within three months, UltimatePoker.com has dealt 10 million hands. 10 million. Now, this is a nice little factoid about the creation of our new business, but recent events really make this number stand out. Uncle Sam let more than a billion dollars in tax revenues slip right through his fingers. Here's how. Online poker players in America sent billions of dollars to companies operating illegally on islands in the middle of the ocean. This money was not taxed, these companies were not regulated, and the American players were not protected. The U.S. government finally shut some of these illegal online companies down in America on April 15, 2011, a day that came to be known as Black Friday. For a decade, we've been looking at this lose-lose-lose proposition when it comes to online gaming. I call it the lost decade. Laws have been changed, and we now have an opportunity to do online poker the right way. One small but very dependable solution to America's debt burden is quite simple. There are an estimated 50 million Americans who love to play poker. It's America's favorite card game. Many of them wish to play online. Let them! Let them by legalizing online poker around America. Regulate the companies that offer it. Create jobs as demand for online poker grows. Use the increase in tax revenue to help pay our debts, rebuild our infrastructure, and improve our schools. That's just what we've been doing in Nevada since April 30th, when Ultimate Poker became the first company to offer real money regulated online poker. UltimatePoker.com is now the largest legal poker room anywhere in America. The results are clear. State-of-the-art technology made in America that is used by Ultimate Poker has stopped anybody under 21 from playing the game. It's also kept out anyone from playing outside Nevada state lines. Regulators have looked over more than 700,000 pages of documents that conclusively prove this. Demand has been huge. In three months, our company has dealt 10 million hands of online poker. 25,000 people have registered to play with verified identities. These registrations have come from all 50 states and 39 countries around the world. Approximately $750,000 is paid out weekly to players in prizes, which is why people are traveling to Nevada to play online poker. The local hotels of our partners, Station Casinos, have benefited when players stop in for a meal or a drink when they come to make deposits or pick up their winnings. Land-based poker revenues are also up, proving that this business is complementary. It all adds up to this. Tax revenue is flowing into the state's coffers. On every level, what our company is doing works. The time we live in demands a change in the way we think. People buy their plane tickets over the internet. They buy clothing and books on Amazon at 4 in the morning. There is now an iPhone app for an electromagnetic mosquito repellent. People also want their entertainment online. The internet defines our generation. Many of the 50 million people in America who love poker wish to play online. It's time to let them. And now we're proving that you can do it in a regulated and safe way. It's time to allow online poker to grow and create technology jobs. It's time to send tax revenues generated by online poker to government coffers across America. It's very simple. Ultimate Poker has led the way and proved that this is a hand where everybody wins.